Hi, this is Andrew Keneally, Communications Director for WCRI, here to tell you about our new study, Reoperation and Readmission Rates for Workers' Compensation Patients Undergoing Lumbar Surgery. This new study quantifies the 30-day and 90-day reoperation and readmission rates for workers' compensation patients undergoing lumbar spine surgeries and compares these rates with those for non-workers' compensation patients reported by other studies. It also discusses the major types of reoperations and the main reasons for readmissions, medical payments per claim, and interstate variation in the prevalence of reoperation and readmission. Let me show you how you can use the study. From the table of contents, you can see the major sections in the study. You can click on each of them and the underlying link will take you to the corresponding chapter. For example, the executive summary provides a high level summary of the key findings from this report. Many readers find this section is a good starting point to learn the most important message from the study. For example, this study found that 7 and 8% of workers' compensation patients undergoing lumbar spine surgery had a reoperation and or readmission within 30 and 90 days after their operation, respectively. Table A and B in the executive summary show these results at a glance. If you want to learn more about these findings, go to the discussion of key findings for a detailed discussion of the results in this study. The study also provides abundant data and figures and tables. You can click on any of these links to see the metrics and results you want. We hope you found this video helpful and will download the report. If you did like this video, please click on the thumbs up button below. Also, please make sure to subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with our latest research and discussions about important workers' compensation topics. Thanks for watching.